Nurgle. Yeah, I probably should have played more games earlier. Probably should have played more games earlier because I guess now I'm going to be playing more, more uh, rowdy. Ooh, he's he's level eight coach. That's something. Block stand firm beast. Oh, he's only got one mighty blow. This is more what I was expecting to play when when I'd be playing Nurgle. Two one seven. All right. It's the only thing is how much damage we're going to take. Um. <laughs> Doesn't even work. It works on the screen. It works on the screen. Tony plays fully. You can see on the uh, you can see on the uh, on the screen there. It does work. Maybe you've got a refresh or something, or clear your cookies or whatever. Um, for it will. I'll be back on the second of January. Goliath Games. The face cam and uh, glorious 1080p will be back. Well, I'm probably not going to stream on the day that I'm back in Germany because it takes the whole fucking day to travel. So. And then the weekend, so probably Monday the 5th. Monday the 5th of February, I'll be back. Face cam and good uh, good, good quality graphics and no lag and stuff. So yeah, it'll be it'll be return to the glory days on the 5th of Feb. Wizard in a chainsaw, perfectly. That is That was an annoying amount of TV to be up, wasn't it? That was a, that was an annoying amount of TV. TBH. I mean, he's got a beast. The beast, although the beast, although you know, I was slating the beast against elves. It isn't that good because it is going to go bonehead at, at one turn and a half, and then when it goes bonehead is when you take advantage, isn't it? Obviously, it can be annoying, annoying in the uh, in the meantime. But it is a weakness. It is a weakness, isn't it? Jimmy Bobblehead. <laughs> I don't know, there's just the Jimmy, isn't there? Uh, double one, yeah, exactly. It's I don't like how high risk they are. Hello, VIP Oriolensis. Well done, congratulations for being saved the other day. Yeah, and now I know the tactic is to uh, entice a double skull serve. <laughs> Sage felt like me for a <laughs> felt like me for a game. <laughs> I like the use of the fireball there as well when you use the fireball. I thought it had to be. A lot of people are are reluctant to use the fireball when they're in a good situation but I think um, you know if you if you but you know like like when Ducky had against me he had a he had a decent shot didn't need to get the ball against me and uh, I think you know I think it's good to use the you know he had a good chance to steal on my drive um, you know, I mean I'm going really really far back again against Ducky oh glorious Thanks for making me a better BB player. Ah, thank you very much. That's brilliant. Thank you very much, Pitizzy. Uh, oh, that's great, isn't it? Thanks very much. Uh, that's good, isn't it? I like stuff like that. Glorious. Um. That's great. Isn't it? Yeah, the case where he had two dice with wrestle on the ball. Yeah, I'm glad you're here, Ducky. Because, I mean, that was a good shot at the ball, right? It was a good shot at the ball. Now, it's a bit different against Wood Elves, because against Wood Elves, against a far superior, you know, a far superior TV, it was. So then the, then the Wood Elves, you, you, you are actually likely to lose the ball on your own drive and use it as a counter whiz. But if you ignore that, if you just look at it as if it wasn't whiz. If, if it wasn't Wood Elves with a huge TV advantage, if it was a closer game, a lot of people would have thought, I've got two dice on the ball with Wrestle, I don't need to use the Wizard. Now, I'm not saying Ducky was wrong to not use the Wizard there at all, because of the situation. But I think that there was certainly a good argument for the Wizard um, because of, you know, you can just go, you know, just to make sure, if you see what I mean. He's given me a uh, 75% to put the saw down there. That's alright, isn't it? He does have a wizard, doesn't he? So, he probably want to carry with a random dodge guy on 10. So if he gets a touchdown, he's, he's another touchdown away. And if he gets a completion, he is an MVP away. And the bad thing is, if I go for the saw here, um... We don't get the tree on the 
Beast which would have been ideal, wouldn't it? This is a catch here. This is a catch that I've put in here. I'll give prize for the media. Gotta put him on here in case of a in case of a fucking uh, Hey! Thanks for making me a worse BB player. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Um. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Goliath. Uh, oh dear. Now if we go here, and there's a screen. Behind the LOS screening the war dancer, obviously mighty blow on the soul because he's armor fucking five. <laughs> Is that right? Is he meant to be armor eight or have they fucked up? Yeah, exactly, Ducky. Yeah, I'm not I'm not I wasn't saying I wasn't saying that uh, that Ducky made the wrong choice, but I was saying yeah, if it was it was close, yeah, I wouldn't agree with that. Yeah, exactly. But I think a lot of people would have agreed it, you know? I think a lot of people would, would want to save the wizard then. And I've done it myself as well before, you know? Um, and I think, really, I think combining a lot of pressure with a wizard can absolutely annihilate somebody. Like the time that Merlock Joe used the wizard against me and missed everybody, I thought that was a great time to use the wizard, even though he didn't really... Oh, is this a guard? Oh, my, my guard isn't here anymore! Oh wow, I fucking done goofed. I gotta block with a tree first. Oh Christ. <laughs> I originally had the guard and then I moved. I thought, I don't need the tree there. Oh, I did need the tree there, didn't I? I actually, turns out, I actually did need the tree there. Balls. Mm hmm. Do you want to reroll the pickup? I actually have to reroll the pickup. So let's go for the pickup. Or two behind in case of a wizard. Would like him screen still. Alright, 2D with him. Okay, let's go. Phew. Lucky me. Haha. <laughs> Appears to be shit sometimes, doesn't it? Do you know what? I should have bucked with him first, shouldn't I? Because he was pushing me. Push I'm playing really bad here. I guess I'm gonna, gonna greed this block. Now. Don't even need to. Sad that I didn't kill the saw. Yeah, for a dirty dingo, or He's got a chainsaw. Yep, yeah, the, the chainsaw's minus three effects the player, yeah. That's why they're so high risk, yeah. Oh, Muldy. Oh, he likes this in the new people's job. 
Yeah, he had loads. He had loads on the on the line. He just started with, with tons on the line. Oh, he's got a mighty blow pest. Shit. All right. So the saw. Oh god, is this show hands? Alright, so we've got a show hands guy to hit, and the hands, and the fucking sword to hit. And the mighty blow to hit. <laughs> yeah, Moldy! <laughs> I'm pretty happy about the <laughs> gym tonight. <laughs> I don't know how much use it'll get, but uh, I saw it and I was like, oh man, I've got to use that. So what answer can blitz him? And then Mighty Blow can block. Oh god, he's just. He can block him. He's doing the classic newbie, everyone gangs up on the tree, isn't he? He can just straight up block him. But then, so, then the Mighty Blow could blitz him and then escape. So that seems like a good thing to do. Okay, so the Mighty Blow's not gonna hit him and escape. Fucking fail. Thought about the board down and all balls, but. Sorry for ignoring chat, it's, uh, it's not easy. Oh wow, that's glorious, Mordripster. Wow. November 2016. Crazy, eh? <laughs> That's pro tips there, Multi. <laughs> pro tips. <laughs> oh, pro tips tells us how you went and played football. Wow. Crazy. Uh, disturbing presence makes it minus one to pass or catch within three squares of the player. So, um, you know, so you can see the, they overlap as well. So if somebody was to catch it here, they'd get like minus three or something to catch. So it can be pretty tricky to do uh, passing plays against Nurgle. Of course, that's pretty niche because mostly people don't want to ever do passing plays. But it kind of caught me the other day. And obviously, wood elves in general. 
might want to pass me. It was my turn, and um, I should only reach out. There's been times when I've read it in both turns, and the play has been very bad. But. Yeah, hands off, yeah. yeah. But I mean, against a wizard, a common tactic for elves against a wizard is to sit back with a, with a quarterback kind of guy, isn't there? So... I'm surprised he hasn't fouled the tree. Normally, people would like to foul the tree, wouldn't they? I just want to pile everything into the saw because I'm scared of his... I'm scared of his soul. Ooh, could try the surf. He has to stand up for it. Okay, so there's definitely no soul here. So I might as well just be greedy. I don't want to hit him, but I guess I can't. Oh man. Made a surf. Outrageous. Got to be wary of a wizard now, haven't I? You could just block if this works. Rather block than dodge. Unfortunately, him getting fucking punched by a beast of Nurgle is maybe better than putting someone else, isn't it? Cyanide dead, Cat Vilma. Cyanide dead. Um, what happened was. Um, I had more than a f I don't it was hard to work out j through uh through that thing what's it called uh L U K site it was it was hard it was hard to work out the exact percentage because I didn't actually need like you know I could have done things with it both down so it was hard to put in the the actual entire thing but there was a greater than 55% chance to score and uh that was after, yeah, Samba. That was after I rolled a double on the foul. There was there was a more than fifty five percent chance to score. Um, so if you if you counted the whole action of the turn, it wasn't. It was uh, it was even greater than that as well. Um, but what happened was, I made a foul with a bribe, got sent off, and wasn't allowed to use the bribe. So it just ended my turn. And uh, the foul was to remove disturbing presence. To make the pass a the catch a one in thirty six fail instead of a one in nine fail, and uh, obviously I wouldn't have made the foul had I known about the bug. So that was that was kind of annoying. Right, so now I can go way forward. I can get out of town. 
I guess I could just have a block at him and then I could always blitz a Pestagore afterwards, but on the other hand, I'd really like to fucking get him out. I could follow and blitz him. Mm. I really want to just hit with Mighty Blow, though, but with block as well. Nah. I guess I could dodge these guys out. It's turn four, so I could go for a one nine for them. Maybe he could dodge out and assist me. Hmm. I'll be a bit greedy. When I say a bit, hugely. <laughs> Blitzing the sure hands now with Mighty Blow. Seems like a really good thing. So he could go an extra two squares. Where could he go to? There, that, that'd be better if he could go there and the other one could go further forward. So let's be a bit greedy. And use dodge. Might fireball now, might he? Hello, Flash Binder. Oh, Kiwi nuts that good time. The shit is sore, isn't stunning? No, he's just he's just got a goblin model. He is uh he is actually Max Clean Ripper. I'm not sure about this armor rate. Can anyone can anyone confirm or deny the actual rules on that? I guess it makes sense because he is quite cheap still. <laughs> That's funny how easy how I fair enough. I just he just five plus dodged in. <laughs> he just five plus dodged in. He just gives no fucks this lad. The orc one's AV9, yeah. Yeah, the orc one's AV9. <laughs> no, yeah, I know, I know, I know, I understand the minus three AV with chain, so I was just thinking that cyanide might have not uh, might have not got the player right, you know? <laughs> they should fast you right. <laughs> they should also instantly lose when they do this, which he, you know, he hasn't instantly lost, but he's almost instantly lost. So that's good, isn't it? Right, would I like to hit your mighty blow? Yes, please. Make the ball safe first. Only to please Fashbinder. Just because Fashbinder's here, we'll, uh, we'll fucking play properly. <laughs> How fucking boring is that?
put 2D the beast, but I think I'd rather just 3D him. Turned over against the beast. We got here. Maybe mm. I shouldn't run away. Actually, it's only two dice. You might go stupid. Sidestep, so I don't know if there's a size. There's a size that jump up stab. There's a stamp firm, so I don't know if there's a sidestep, so. Yeah, the Orcs AV9. It's just that I thought, you know, with Max Bleenrupper being a human, like a Chaos Warrior base, I thought maybe he would, uh. Maybe he would, uh. And, and, and I just thought Cyanide might have got it wrong. Hello, Brandhill. Yeah, glorious. The only thing missing is Tom Brandhill. <laughs> he does do it completely wrong. Doesn't doesn't assist him. Maybe he'll put someone in afterwards. I shouldn't say things when people are playing, should I? I did put someone next to him. Straight for the ball. Gives no fucks. <laughs> he just doesn't care. He's like, <laughs> see the ball. I'm going for it. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, right. So I want to tag him so I can three dice him, and then I'll have an assist for the chainsaw. And put a guy over here. Put the ball over here. Smash him to pieces with a strength two gun. Oh, fuck. Where's the blitz coming? I want to be mighty blow on, on him, don't I really? Right, I don't look for him. Three dice with the trees. And he's fucking. Uh... No, I don't get the guard in, do I? Bollocks. Three dice on the show hands is. is glorious. Two guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then there's only one guy blocking. Him. A little bit risky. I don't think Fashbinder would approve of this play. But, you know. Also, I'm not getting punched into the tree, am I? I realised you could just score to get rid of him, couldn't I? <laughs> yeah, I could have, could have literally just scored. Uh, ah. Yeah. <laughs> could have just scored. Never mind, eh? It doesn't make a broad <laughs> Yeah, backdoor Billy, I just got it. <laughs> I just got it. I forgot I'm, I forgot I'm what else and I can just score. 
Yeah, I wasn't. I wasn't doubting it working all right. I just thought the only thing that I thought was I thought maybe he should be armor nine because he's a chaos warrior. That was all. He's on forty seven. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I shouldn't laugh. He's new, isn't he? He's new to Blood Bowl. He's a level six. He's a level six coach. I'm not being mean to him. It's just funny that he's just like, fuck it, fuck it. I don't even care. He's just like, don't tell me the odds, <laughs> and goes for all the dodges in the world. I mean, it's not. I'm not being nasty to him. Either. I don't think so. Anymore. But he's still he's still getting closer, isn't he? Oh she is anyway. Oh no rerolls, please don't die. Brilliant uh, take no damage this. Okay, so can we do a safe move first? Mm. This guy. Only three dice in because I can't really get in there. This guy too. Good flash watching, it makes me play safer than I would if he wasn't. Got to appease flash in his, his, uh, his, what's it called, uh, conservative tendencies. I can be score. Well, I'm scoring next turn anyway. So all I have to do is protect against fireball and bolt. Can put him on there anyway. Yeah. Just out of the way a little bit. And he can screen off. Maybe I should have put him there. Just two dice in there. Oh, brilliant. If he stays out, I guess it's two KO rolls, so he's unlikely to stay. But if he does, it's pretty good losing uh, Losing... Sure hands for his line. Would be pretty... Huge. Didn't feel the diamond tackle guy. It's diamond tackle, isn't it? Probably shouldn't have taken diamond tackle. His <laughs> desire for Blood Bowl to be played properly. <laughs> Good afternoon, Kogar. VIP Kogar. Yeah, sure, I'm question. Let's see that. Maybe he should have... He should have been here or here. This desire for purple. No, it's right. I mean, it's right. It is risk mitigation, isn't it? I should have... Should always do those kind of safe moves first. It's just easy to think that you're not going to 1 in 12, 9, 6. 
But of course, one in 1296 times, you do one in 1296. So it is worth being prepared for that eventuality. Yeah, that's true, Lemon is good, yeah, that is true. Though he's got to set up on the LOS to do it, which is... Yeah, I shouldn't have let him blitz him, should I? I'm three dice as well. <laughs> Get behind him. No, I could chain him. Nah, if I had a frenzy, I could chain him. Could surf him. Can't surf him. Can KO him though. Can reach him, is it? I think he's more likely to knock him over, and also his armor eight instead of armor nine doesn't have uh, foul appearance. But on the other hand, the payoff and taking out the thing is just massive, isn't it? He'll just stand firm even if I uh, even forget a push here. I should have said it would better so that I could have blocked the catcher if I got a push. Okay. Doesn't doesn't matter. Got a second chance. On 13, so another touchdown for 30 Bob Face, and he will uh, he will get blocked or robbed or done. come back that's that's sad i mean I, I know there was two chances but i would have really liked the the short hands to uh to stay out aha i've saved i've saved the garbage time formation good for me I like, how, I like how he's just too good to even play. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's not going to be able to one turn here. So. Yeah, Blood Judge Floyd. Movement 7, Blood Judge Floyd is pretty good. It would be a position on any bashy team, wouldn't it? The thing is, my, my rule of five, right, on the pitch is the two war dancers and kind of a catcher. I've got like three good players and the rest are just... So I can definitely have a... a like, I would really like... I would love a guard. I would love a blodge guard liner. I would fucking love that. That's pretty good, job. Blodge tackle size, that's pretty good. Um... Because the, the really good player, one of the really good players, doesn't ever play, does he? <laughs> so there's definitely room for a few good more. I mean, of guard and the catcher would make him great, obviously. But yeah, I think I think there's room for one or two good linemen on an elf team. Especially wrestle, just because I mean, you know, wrestle dodge they can do rando sacks very well. Free up space very well. 
I can all just go wrestle now. I mean, an elf lineman isn't like a fucking all lineman, is it? No. All climbing, you've got eight guys that you want to be legends, <laughs> you know, and and you and you're a bashy team and everything. Whereas this, there's only five players I want to be legends. But even if I got them all a legend, only four would be on the pitch. So. Because I could have only thrown blood to your hands. Fast. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good, cover on. <laughs> it was adding the living rules. It was adding in living rule book five in fact all of them. It was a, a very very recent skill. Maybe I'm lying. I'm pretty no, I'm pretty sure it's living rule book five. Pretty sure it wasn't in Living Rule Book 4. So, I'm gonna go for Living Rule Book 5. Pretty certain. Oh, the Warrior. Warrior Bright with Warrior Foul with no Bright. Maybe he's frustrated. Wrestle Fen. Juggernaut Grab, all of them. I can stand for him now. I'd take that. To be honest, Terry Koo, I'd take that every game. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Red Joker. I would like I would like some more blood. And I would like to be over 80 points. Um You know, because I, I would like to be able to sit on them, just due to uh, just due to obviously people can make late runs with with woodies because they're fucking busted. So maybe I could get a, just a, I could just get a third catcher, I guess, couldn't I? And then I'd have wouldn't need wouldn't care so much about the line Because at the moment I've got one shit catcher and one good catcher and two warlances in defence. But even then, I don't like having the strength too sometimes enough that I don't think I'd want to. A third one on defense, and obviously might have three uh, if he gets if someone gets injured. I'm gonna make the setup worse in an effort to uh, not get killed by a nutrition fireball. <laughs> That's living rule book three, not third ed. Jelly deals. Well, the, the URL is in rule book three, so it's not really third ed rules, is it? Um, they did remove the pylon skill from Fumble uh, because it is removed. He he eternally sits on the bench, BB Snow, so that he can he can come off to the he can, so he can come off the bench to score a touchdown. <laughs> yeah, that's doing it. He's like what two twenty or something. Uh, he's ninety plus one hundred and fifty, is he? And ninety base aren't the catchers because Lionel's are seventy, so they've got to be ninety. And he's got three normal skills. That's sixty, one hundred and twenty. But one hundred and twenty skills, so he's two ten. Is that right? He's 210. And then these were 160. <laughs> so even if there was five reserves, he'd still be worth it. And can still fireball. Yeah, I should have uh, put these apart, shouldn't I? Good, good catch. Just one minute work a week. Yeah, it'd be a pretty good job, wouldn't it? <laughs> be a pretty good job if you were if you were that guy.
What Norse do without piling on? Don't get piled on themselves. Mostly. DP all men's. Yeah, exactly. They, they, it's not like they were good when they got piling on. They were good. They were good at, at 1,100 math style. <laughs> I mean, the big thing is, most don't get piled on themselves. Isn't so, lizard men obviously benefit hugely because skinks don't get tackle pond and war and uh, saurus don't get claw pond. So they got the best deal. They're good at low TV. <laughs> They're good at low TV and that they count their elves a bit. But um I really don't like no. <laughs> I really hate the idea of an armor seven bash team. It grinds my gears. Yeah, obviously, yeah, all the elves got better. That's true. But then also, people could pile on. If people piled on, um, if people pile on, they open up space though. So piling on can lose you a game versus elves sometimes. Should I just not stand firm so I don't get hit by the beast? I guess so. I'd rather be standing up. I think so, Tony. Yeah, it's it's pretty much always a, a magnet, the tree. Now I've got a sneaky man hiding behind the tree, just like you know. Oh, this is annoying that he's got two hands, isn't it? Randomly. Oh man, I can block him and follow. And you've got the assist. For the leap. Two dice. I probably shouldn't leap against this coach though, should I? Now he just takes my ego down. Well done, basing me. Good. Don't give up additional blocks. Lesson learned? Maybe not. Might just be thinking, this is so much bullshit, I'm so unlucky, as if I'm getting out bashed by the world. That's a shame, that was the assist for him. I was relying on the power there to be able to blitz, uh, blitz him, wasn't it? Ooh, I could just block him. And get the, uh, although it opens up the centre of the field, horrific. Horrific, but open centre of the field. But it gets us a mighty blow hit on his mighty blow. <laughs> Third double skulls of the match. Pretty sure I haven't made uh, 108 blocks. So I think I could count myself a little unlucky. Hmm. 
I guess I'm trying to this one out to the danger zone first. Okay, good run. Blitz him and then base both one, two, three, four, GFI. I don't know if base both war dancers do, I even know. The defense is a little slacker being further back. Yeah, I can see the appeal of Norse and that, you know, it's just that I just don't like an arm, mechanically I don't like an arm of seven. Yeah, I, I, I agree, Harry, I would never recommend people using them, how much they like it, you know, tree fetish is important. <laughs> I, I, I guess that's true, don't I, in, in, in many respects. Did three dies in my own blood. That's a shame. But he's he's is uh his beast is heavily committed now, isn't it? So he's got three guys on the tree. Three guys in there. <laughs> Hello, nosedive. I'm not. I'm on a losing streak currently. Because <laughs> he needs to. You know, I don't say anything. Yes, thanks, Imber Augustus. One, one's one of these two, isn't it? Yeah, him. What about him? But him is these two. So one can be a kind of, I can't believe you've got the power. Lucky bastard. I mean, if he got the push there, it was huge, wasn't it? Because he's looking at one dice as well. And these guys looking tied up was now enough to actually guess to protect. Sucks having no guard at all. I'm not protecting with him. It's worked out now, hasn't it? With that last uh, that last move, after one dice him to maybe get in for an assist, I could chain this guy into a one dice. Doesn't seem ideal. Could chain him out, but it would only be one dice then. I really don't have to re roll a three plus. It's like doing a leap, isn't it? Which is about the fucking worst thing you can do. It'd kind of be hard, difficult to get somebody over there as well. It's a GFI over there. Three plus him, push him out, tag him, and blots him. 
and then get the ball and score. So, I mean, there's a lot of pit off. The only thing is, should lie on a three plus. I think I'm going to go for it because I can get him back to cover a little bit. Dodge is gone. Maybe I don't go for it now. Nah, fuck it, I'm committed. Pot committed. Oh, you cunt. Alright, no more rerolls for half. Now I'm not committed. I have to, have to change plans now. Oh, here, diving tackle. I dodged through diving tackle. That wasn't clever, was it? Yeah, I probably shouldn't have gone for the three plus anyway. Pretty shit first game of the day, so I'm not surprised. Okay, let's let's yes, let's, let's use dodge. I guess I could keep him on him, so he doesn't get two down. Although it keeps me on the piece, which sucks. Again, really. Give me a free plus dodge. Get a D2 in there for two minutes. Ah, it was easy to fucking. Easy to miss, wasn't it? You don't expect a fucking rotter to have diamond tackle. Yeah, maybe the Lord Answer should have got away from the beast, but. He could have blocked. Uh, could have blocked him with that assist. Oh, chain, eh? Very good. Oh. Not that good. Fucking knockout. Yeah, I've fucked up that turn a bit, didn't I? It's just shit not having any guard. If I had any guard, I would have just stuck a guard in and two dice the ball, but can't fucking do it. I didn't want to one dice the ball. Sure. 
for the classic one dice on the ball. I guess he can come, come back here. One dice on the ball without a reroll. All one dice are skulls. Is what Fash says. He's wrong. I think he's kind of alright where he is. Calls me Dodger. Oh man. Not looking good, is it? Good and ugly man. Right, so we can go over there. And 
and he could blitz, get a pow, and then go four, five, six, seven, and get the assist. So I need someone to go in there. I dodged, can't see that assist. Camera move, didn't it? Fucking camera move, man. Oh, fix your fucking game sign now. Is it is it too much to ask to not just have the camera randomly fucking move? Jesus wept. No recovery now, and I don't know, might as well go for it. Down in the dumps about how shit they're getting me. Hope so. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the way. Boop, boop, boop. Fucking the random camera move. <laughs> oh man. Just gotta remember to take a long time to click. But fucking shouldn't have to. I like how this tree has just fucking failed about three stand-up rolls in a row as well. Just because you don't remember doesn't mean it didn't happen though, does it, fam? <laughs> Dodges. That was a horrible, horrible first turn. Um, okay, so don't double click. Click stand up, because a double click might lead to a GFR, because the camera might randomly move. Um, and stand up.
One dice. This 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 should work, shouldn't it? A one dice. It did work. Two dice should definitely work. Wow. Fash dice there. Ball's over here. Random. Oh, he's the 13 one as well. That's alright, isn't it? Oh, that was a bad move by him. Unless he's move busted. No, he's not. He should have put him in there, shouldn't he? Put him 3 2 out instead of just a 2 out. Pushes him out of tentacles. Controversial. Ah, oh, but he's in diving tackle, I guess. So that's, that might have been a good point, actually. Encourage me to dodge from diving tackle rather than... Uh, rather than get stuck by a tree. Yeah, thanks, Kyle. It actually was planned at one point. I did say it was a 13 guy when he went somewhere. Um, when he went round here to get the thing. But obviously, that turned out. The scatter turned out. Pretty amazing. Yeah, By blocking, I can free up one player. Hey, well done, tree. I knew you could do it. Oh, that's not. He's not strength. He's not strength. So. So you can do the blitz then. Probably should just dodge him out there. Yeah. I mean, I don't care now, I think it's a win. Even if he bolts him, he's only got two turns left to score himself. He 
did remember he had a whiz. Yeah, he's got to be. I mean, he's it's got to be like a noble warrior touchdown, basically, hasn't it? And he's got a dog this turn. So I don't, know, I don't think he's going to do it. Serves so three men for cards. <laughs> Oh, and he, he left him. He left him to go and score for us. That was nice. Of him. Yeah, it was a shame. That that bolt was a shame, wasn't it? Wasn't it? I would have liked to have just, uh, you know, been four squares closer so I could have just scored right to your friend. But I mean, e even if I'd been in range, which I could have been, because I, I didn't go as far forward as I could have done. Even if I'd been in range of two GFIs, I wasn't going to make them. I wasn't going to attempt them. <laughs> That's funny, isn't it? I mean, all the, all the, pretty much all of the Linos are in line for a, an MVP level up, which is good. So to score, he has to uh, score with one of the, the Beast, who's Agility 1, and a loner. Or this particular Noble Warrior, who's Agility 1. So, his score isn't looking uh, too likely. Dicker do GFIs. Oh, diamond tackle. <laughs> Whoa, it just fucking. It just fucking disappeared! I was still thinking! For fuck's sake! <sighs> Great, so you don't even get 15 seconds to decide whether to use your fucking apothecary. You get an arbitrary length of time, which is less than fucking 15 seconds. Wow! Okay, good job I didn't. Better do it straight away before the timer randomly runs out before 15 seconds. Fuck off. I would up on a line or because there was only fucking one turn left. There was one turn left of blocks. I, w I would have liked I would it, but then Apple was a death anyway. 13, really not the game for him to level up. Fucking hell. Oh. 
how fucking dumb is the the apple is just a random length of time how have I never had that before is that just happened with legendary no I should try to dodge him out I would have probably failed tense anyway what would have done I would have failed tense anyway I guess I should have uphill blit blitzed. I should have uphill blitzed that guy out. I need a fucking touch going on him anyway. Yeah, nice extra arms. Double ones. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. That's a lot of dead line the last few games. I would have apple the first one, I think. But then obviously he was happy that I hadn't when the <laughs> when Thor died <laughs> instantly after and then it fucking failed anyway because of fucking course it did. I hear the reroll. When you reroll, it's the same result, and it just feels like it hasn't rerolled. Cyanide is so bad, I don't think it does reroll. It should have a fucking rolling dice animation, for fuck's sake. God damn it. 52 blocks. You can't take 52 blocks and expect people to not die, really. Man. I don't know what I was looking at the dice for. Oh, the stand-up might have been funny. I think class two failed by. Right. So this is... 11 players. So I could just get one more guy. One Lino. And then, uh, you know, have the edge three and then maybe he's get rid of him later. I really don't want to sack anybody when they can just die. So yeah, I think I'll buy a new lineup. But a win's a win. It's probably not broken, but they're so bad that I wouldn't, I, I can't trust them. So it should have... It should have a. It should have a fucking timer, shouldn't it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's true, Johnny Five. Yeah. Um, right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>